Hey yo, what's up my beloved champions fam, it's the bad guy at WWE Champion Zeke 4 0 back with a brand new video and we are now here to collect the rest of our bonus points, although we do not have Hall of Fame striker Vader, rest in paradise my boy, we were able to acquire the backstage pass to fuse up our PG era powerhouse Braun Strowman, the new face of destruction, and of course we were able to recruit a certain lead guy, you know what I mean, former senior money in the bank, and now El Champion, Damian Priest, all rise for the Judgment Day, a fellow brethren of the Uzen Machismo Court. We are going to go ahead and utilize him right here, and we're actually going to pull off something really interesting. I want to see if we can quote unquote take it back in the day because right now our guy is sitting at level 50 right now back if you know you may know because i used to do this all the time for the star fragment blitzes with natty um trickster natty so before she got her rework right basically what you would do is i would literally have natty at level one and i would have her steel health move at the uh, fully maxed out and i would have that one on the side so what we have going on here is what we're going to do is we're going to trade this over and we're going to drop our overall so it's looking like this but as soon as we hop in we're going to swap in the move set that we're going to utilize i just want to see for old time's sake if this works if not we will get serious if it costs us a blitz ticket it costs us a blitz ticket but for old time's sake i just gotta know so we're going to go ahead and do this right here we do not have the resources currently after the talent up we do not have the resources to take him up to six star bronze but we certainly will in the future so we are in now and now we are going to go ahead and swap in our move set and this is this is absolutely lovely so now we have this up we're now up to went from 5k to 9k and this is the setup that we're going to be running we have the choke slam dealing damage and decreasing our countdown gem timer by two then we have the razor's edge dealing damage and making nine random gems into three turn countdown gems that will deal damage and make random gems into four red gems the making four random gems into red gems at the end of the countdown and last but not least we have the jumping corkscrew roundhouse kick dealing damage plus bonus damage for every countdown on the gem so a uh, countdown gem that's uh, available so this is what we're go what we got right now we have we got a uh, butch for plus four move um, uh, move points for plus four red mp then we have judgment day balor Red moves will do 100% more damage, and red moves start with two more MP. We have Zombie Bianca, Zonkia, allowing moves and gems, Trap, Countdown, and Juggernaut that generate red gems will create two more and increase our kickout damage but done by gems by 10%. And then, of course, Tech Stacy popping up once again. 12k flat rate gem damage now obviously we could obviously put um zombie priest in for 30 percent more gem damage we also have tech cena um veteran salute he allows us to generate an additional countdown gem too we also could put icon sting in for plus four red mp so we are ensuring that we're getting all of our red moves off this is a trial and error thing because literally this is the first time i'm using priest so we're going to see how this goes and granted we do have other builds that we could utilize but for kicks and giggles i wanted to see what we could do here and it looks like we were able to pull off the old um the 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 the, the old switch and go so i am grateful for that and we are going to dominate because the ai just lost one so we just need to do two runs with this and we will be able to get our bonus points get in and get out and call it a day so this is this is fun i am a huge fan of damian priest especially knowing how much of a fan and uh, he is and uh, is of scott hall the bad guy so it's actually highly fascinating and lo and behold look what we have here now this could go a multitude of ways one with finn balor on him he's going to be doing crazy damage like that then we go ahead and we could do the extra damage if we wanted to bing bong just like that and then we go ahead and drop that and once the second turn hits 
we can go ahead and now we can hit this to decrease it and then we spam the board with reds and with text Stacy on them it's over so this is an easy way to cheese content y'all this is something to consider now granted everybody's working their way up and trying to do what they got to do with their roster so not everyone is sitting on characters where certain moves are fully maxed out and they're trading in level ones for the fully loaded move i get that but you know for the content i'm glad that it worked out because more than likely no lie i probably didn't even have to put any levels into them i could have just done that right out of the gate Look Looking at how things went but i'd rather have a little cushion for us so we don't just flatline so that's good to know that is great to know that we were able to do this right here so we're going to keep on rolling we're going to take out miz and we're going to take care of omos omos might be the only bit of problem here just because omos has low charge moves so that might be the one where i'm sitting there like okay we might want to uh reconsider and reevaluate our uh, our our life choices here so we are going to go ahead once again we'll put these down and we're doing we're doing damage and then we have the countdown we don't even have to hit the countdown so that is something to also consider here so we will do the four row cross break that's going to break them and then miz is down for the count simple and plain and then we will move on to the colossus omos and we'll have one more run. I mean, easily, it's a, it's a, it's a build that. I mean, it just feels good to take it back in a day of how you 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 could do things like the little little interesting player insights that made the game fascinating when you didn't have the roster to take on all content. You had to figure out ways to be smart so you can survive and get the extra resources that you need. So I'm actually happy that they still like enable that to happen. So five star gold against a three star silver Omos. But again, remember. Technically, I mean, we're only at level 50, so we will see how this works out. But with Tech Stacy, if everything works out appropriately, it'll be golden. And plus, with the countdown gem damage and everything, we should be good to go. Now, there are a couple ways that we could work around this, too, because even though it's a three-turn countdown gem, we could easily decrease it by two so the following turn everything goes off blows up the board with the red too so that is another way to consider looking at things if omas doesn't cause us trouble so that's another way to look at getting your dub is by literally like setting it off right there and then you just gotta wait and see uh, like how much of the board he'll play around with and then go from there so okay next turn when he connects something boom Everything's going to blow up. Cascade, we're fully loaded again. I wish that my uh, my priest was high enough. How does that work? I literally got hit with my own move by Omos. Y'all saw that, right? You saw... Some of the glitches in Champions make me question things. But, look, it's easy with this build right here to do it. And, obviously, if you have them even higher up, then you have nothing to worry about for sure. But this is cool. I know with his skip turn, uh, skip turn, that makes things a whole lot more fun and entertaining to participate in and do. But we are doing this for the content, for the entertainment. Are you not entertained? So we got one more to do, and again, it's simple. It's like, it's a few clicks. What's, what's a few clicks when everything's said and done just to pull off these shenanigans? It's like, hey, why not have a little fun in the game? So we're back to 5K, 5K flat, and then we agree. Boom, we are back in on the grid, 1250, and then you go back in, manage, Manage. Boom. 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 And we are golden. We are back on the grid. And Damon's going to sweep this once more. So, I mean, look, we might as well just get everything out of the way. I mean, look, there's a lot going on this week. A lot going on. So, we are just going to rock and roll. We are going to get this done boom do we really have to wait for anything nope we're just going to finish them off and come and complete the sweep so there goes his razor's edge that 
Omaha sitting the razor's edge is unique. I mean, that would actually be a terrifying finisher when you think about it with how big the dude is. But, boom, we got that. We keep on rolling. We keep on moving. So, we... <laughs> As y'all have probably seen, we have been on a roll, um, got uh, got off work, and we've just been unloading these videos, just recording them back to back to back, talent up, then uh, from talent up to taking care of Reigns' tour with the SummerSlam with, as a contest superstar, then taking care of these blitzes, doing the six-star gold loopholes. We've just been a busy, busy bee, so it's all good. It's, it's fun to like to be able to... A re release so much content and get it to y'all because it it's worth it you know this game makes me happy this game brings me peace i'm truly grateful and thankful for the people that i've gotten to meet through this game and just to meet so many like minds and incredible people thanks to uh, you know who would have thunk it a, a mobile game you know that's something to treasure and i'm grateful for so you know, it feels good, the, the, the hint of nostalgia of being able to take up guys and work with guys that I used to use to clear everything and anything back in the day, like PG era powerhouse Braun, to finally recruiting people that I've always loved and adored when it comes to like wrestlers like Damian Priest and even the storylines I've seen thanks to um, Roman Reigns, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm all hyped for it. It's always good to just get to use these different characters that I don't, they, they aren't my go-tos, they aren't my heavy hitters, but we can go ahead and enjoy the moments that come from this. The nostalgia is the bit. I am, I am all in. So we are about to wrap this up with a big Judgment Day bow. Live, lived and gone rogue. If you don't know, you need to check out the check out the latest episode of Raw. She at Dom broke her heart, and she she's come back for blood. She when she said she was going to take everything from mom uh, from mommy Rhea, she meant it tenfold. So, ugh, wouldn't let that happen to me too. <laughs> so let's go ahead and knock this out. Let's get this done, and we are going to call it a day. We don't have to really do anything. Like I said. Depending on the board, depending on how things fall, we'll go ahead and decrease it right there. And then we will just keep on moving, keep on trucking. So he's going to do what he do. Oh, wow, he didn't even opt for the move this time. AI was just like, nah, you, we, we, we chose violence and it did not go in our favor. Again, what is going on with him to eat. I, I don't have the answers but y'all are seeing what happened but that is the clean sweep we got all the bonus characters done that we possibly could for this blitz right now the for right now i want to hold off a little bit just to see if they add any extra characters to do this outside of hall of fame vader but um that's that's pretty much it we knocked out the bronze we knocked out damian priest we got the flawless victory and it felt good just to kick back and do that little uh that little um little hack in-game hack to um get some real good shenanigans going on but nonetheless y'all that is the video i hope that y'all enjoyed it if you really did like the content and you like what you see and like what you hear and you like to chop it up with your boy by all means do yourselves a favor like the video Share the video with your friends and loved ones and fellow champions players or those who want to get into the game. And then most the most important part of it all, if you're like me and you enjoy this game, you enjoy the simple things of life and you just want to kick back and just let's just build together. Whether you're playing the game and you need some, uh, someone to be uh, be there for you in spirit or, you know, just doing things, living through me vicariously when it comes to pulls and gameplay, look, I'm here for you. So, like the video, share the video, but most importantly of all, subscribe to the channel and do yourselves a real favor by hitting that bell icon to receive all future notifications from yours truly, the bad guy of WWE Champions, Zeke 4 the most electrifying content creator in WWE Champions Entertainment. I love you all. I respect you all, and I'm praying for you all. Bad times don't last. So, you know, champions do. So we got through it. So I would say this one more time and do it the appropriate way because I'm not sure if I said it, but I'll make sure I say it now. Hey, yo, hard work pays off. Dreams come true. Bad times don't last, but champions do.
Thank you all so much for check checking this video out. But thank you to those who support, who show love and support me with every video that I drop. Thank you to those who are subscribed to the channel. I'm glad and I'm thankful to see the channel on the right track, rebuilding, growing. Who knows how many more people will join our beloved Champions fam. But nonetheless, those that are already rocking with me, thank you so much. I love you. I appreciate you. You keep you keep on motivating me and inspiring me to get back to what I love to do, and that's covering this incredible game through the best of times as well as the worst of times. The bad times don't last. We already know that, so that means plenty of good times ahead, plenty of memories to be made. So thank you all. I will bid you adieu. Hope you're enjoying the content, and there's plenty more to come with all these tours, the extreme rules. We're going to have a busy block for this uh, for this week, best believe. And then the flash view, uh, flash view coming up this weekend. We're going to do our best to get that final Aussie vinyl. We are going to do our best to try to get that six star gold fuse. But if not. We're definitely going to be living really good and eating well when it pertains to having at least a six-star silver fuse of Ozzy when it's all said and done. And we will take him up to six-star gold once the TP is right because the coins are already good. But until then, I bid you all adieu. Hey, yo, Lego. Priest was a beast in this. Pun intended. Peace.